this video I'm going to show you how to create a progress step bar in Figma so it's quite easy so let's get started so first of all we will create some frame I already have this mobile frame we will create a stepper for this this stepper can be used for um, forms or anything okay so in in steppers we have this progress bar first of all and then we have some kind of text box which indicates like what step is this and then i'll create this inside the circle keep it in the center align it give some radius so it will be in the form of circle i will not beautify it too much because the main purpose of this video is just to showcase you how to create uh, the stepper okay this is the step one okay and uh, now uh, what we can do we can basically duplicate this bar once again like this and this will be the initial stage initial stage will be little bit filled and I will group it like this now when we are in first stage it's looking like this we can give some uh, text also like uh, label here some text will go it can go here or here I'll, I'll keep it here in this area and I'll align it and uh, now I can do it the center line everything is in auto layout so yeah this is done I will adjust the high sorry the width so stepper is done now what I can do I'll make it a component now this is the default state we have I'll make it a line center like this okay now this is the component one add a variant of it now this is the default state where progress is almost uh, you can say zero okay but now it should show a filled state so red color will be filling it and this number will be filled also like this and this we can make bold now like this okay so this is the unfilled this is the filled now go to the prototype attach it and on click we will basically just do smart animate and now let's use it let's uh, test it first okay so where is this component here it is the component now I will basically preview it and here you can see if I click on it it's working really nicely if I just duplicate it <coughs> three times like this and in, 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 in case of the last one we don't need this bar now so I'll just select this bar and pass through value I'll hide it now I will center line it and I can change the content here with two this is the three and here is the step one here is the st step sorry step two this will be s step three okay now let's see if it's working nicely or not and I'll add some background to it so you know it looks little beautiful as compared to other things and I'll add some content like this here I'll add this okay cool now let's preview it <coughs> and here we go it's working really nicely but the thing is we don't want you know every time to click on these steppers we want like if somebody clicks on some kind of arrow then it should work so in that case what we can do I'll just create duplicate of it and in duplicate just keep it like this variant okay filled now third step keep it filled now next step last one keep it filled so now we have all these states so what we can do uh, 
here we can create some kind of uh, button maybe which is called next so we have this next button here I'll just duplicate it on all the places like this okay now uh, I'll just go to the prototype and on click I can go to all the pages like connect all these pages and r r basically run this preview now and here we go if I click on the next you can see it's working nicely so this is how you create it thank you so much for watching have a great day see ya